Welcome to Seattle. What's up, man? I'm Molly. Just about to tell me. Well, Brad, welcome back. I know um, a lot of Sounders fans are really happy with that. So first things first, just for you, your general initial feelings on being back in Seattle. Yeah, it's a great feeling. Um, obviously, I knew it was was in the works for, for a little bit, but um, needed to get over the line. But now I'm here. I'm, I'm super happy that it's, uh, it's all gone through. And yeah, I can't wait to be back part of the Sounders family. It, it felt like it felt like I wasn't gone really, but it was almost a year, I think. So it's gone quite quick. If I'm not wrong, I think the last time we saw you would have been maybe MLS Cup, I think, against Toronto, if I'm not wrong. So obviously a great day for the club, um, the whole city. What, what's your memories from that day? Yeah, it's a crazy game. I remember being in the hotel the, the, the night before the game and um, the day, and it was just a, it's just a surreal feeling. And, and the game itself was, was crazy with all the fans there. and. Um, and then it was, it, was a, it was a weird feeling for me because we obviously won and then I had to leave like two or three hours after the final. Like I was celebrating with everyone and then I had to say goodbye. It was just like a weird feeling then, but um, it was a great day. And yeah, it's really been a year since that, since that day, but I'm so happy to be back. Oh, this one's going to work out. Smith here behind. The cross to attacking end. It's redirected home. Smith with a delicious delivery. And Will Bruin does the rest. In the time you've gone, were you able to keep in touch with any guys on the team, whether it's the coaching staff, um, training staff, whoever? Were you able to maintain some of those relationships? Yeah, 100%. I feel like that's a big factor of me coming back. I met, met some great people here and made some great friends. And you know what it's like in football, you, you make a lot of friends, but um, until you like, disappear from, from the place you were living with them, um, you realize that they are real friends and, and you stay in contact with them even when you're miles away so um yeah it's definitely a big factor in me coming back knowing knowing the way the team plays all the players the coaching staff everyone obviously you had options elsewhere options overseas why seattle why was that important for you to get it done i just i was just so happy here man um the fans are amazing here even when i left they were <laughs> there for the year they were constantly messaging me on twitter instagram and uh, that's what that's what you want man it's great fan. you know the fans like here there to come back there I was happy and it, and it feels like home, so I feel like it's just a great fit for, for me and the club and it was the right time and um, yeah, it worked out well. And then lastly, before we let you go, um, any words for the fans um, on, on your comeback now? I'm sure they'll be watching this um, at some point. Any words for the fans? Just want to say like, you don't realise how important um, you guys are and for all the people that kept messaging me um, and, and making me feel so loved even when I was away from the club and kept saying come back get Brad Smith back get back um, I feel like that that's a that's a huge factor in, in me coming back and, and it's a great fan base here and I can't wait to get everyone back in the, the stadiums after everything's calmed down with the pandemic so I'm super excited to be back at um, at the at the stadium and, and hear the, the clap again so it's, it's a great moment